100 years ago, monsters raged across Victusia. They destroyed farms, decimated the dwindling animal population, and attacked our people on sight. Famine and death swept the land. No one had dared to hunt and cook monsters for centuries, fearing their cursed flesh. It was then that King Heinrich and Chef Robichaud delivered Victusia from the brink of extinction. Together, they built the finest culinary institution this world has ever seen, the Battle Chef Brigade, a legion of elite soldier chefs on the frontier of the culinary world. Now, battle chefs across the land stand as our protectors and providers, bringing monster cuisine from hunt to table. As summer begins, so does our tournament, drawing forth the next generation of culinary warriors. What new styles of cooking will we witness this year? What tantalizing dishes will be revealed? This year's tournament is sure to be our fiercest yet. I'm off to the market. Don't buy the blue squiggle again. It tasted spoiled last time. I'll ask the brigadiers about it. Where's Saskia? Trying to wake Mina up. She just keeps saying ten more minutes. Mina, get down here now. Saskia, let's go. We're already late. Mina, if you don't come down this instant. I'm up. Stop yelling. Is the restaurant on fire or something? You know it's busiest on Fridays. Finish that Karana Mabo Tofu order for table two. Hmm. All right. Ma, these ingredients taste a bit off to me. A couple of things we got from the market were strange. Not sure what's going on. One bow run noodle soup. On it. stayed up training for the brigade again, didn't you? Uh, it was Saskia's idea. Ha, huh, I suppose it was Saskia's idea the last ten times, too. You know, your father and I would love you to apply, but we need you here. We're not going to be around forever, and your sister isn't even married. <sighs> Ma, please. Ah, oh, I just saw Simon outside. Go gather some fresh ingredients. He looks like he's in the mood for something off-menu. I can always tell by how much he's slouching. His standards aren't that high. A 50-point dish should do.
Mina. Got a new experiment for me to try? You bet. Only the finest from our backyard. Dig in. It's horrible. Oh, what? That can't be. I tasted it myself. <laughs> nah, it's actually good. But I have to keep your ego in check. Don't scare me like that. Oh, Simon, it looks like we'll need some extra satchels of grain and flour. We're running through it a lot faster than expected. Mina, go over to Simon so he doesn't have to make a double trip. I really don't mind. You live so close by. Hush, I'll go. Give this money to his father when you get there. Thank you, Mrs. Han. Be back in a flash. Simon, wait. Before we get there, I need to tell you something. What's up? I'm not going to be around for a while. Ha! Ah, did you get grounded for brigade training again? This isn't a joke. I'm finally going to do it. I'm going to run away from home. <laughs> Mina, I think you're way too old for that now. I'm not throwing a tantrum. Mom and Dad will never let me leave for the brigade. If I wait for their permission, I'll be stuck cooking the same recipes for the same people forever. That's not necessarily true. You could change up the menu. When I make it in, I'll get to travel the land and learn about everything in the world of food. That's more than I could ever do here. You're serious then? Dead serious. I've got what it takes and I'm not growing enough around here where everyone's happy just doing the same old stuff. Well... Oh, your mom is gonna flip. And the only person who scares me more than my dad is your mom. Couldn't you wait till the restaurant picks back up a bit? It hasn't been doing so great lately. Plenty of new travelers will be passing through on their way to the Proving Tournament. They'll be fine. You don't own a coin your parents haven't given you first. How are you gonna... Nina Han, you rogue. Now I'm gonna be an accomplice. I knew I could count on you. This money is just enough to apply and a bit extra. Think you could help a neighbor out and spot me some flour? I don't like this. But how can I refuse my favorite neighbor? Thank you, Simon. <sighs> we should get going. Our parents are going to be annoyed that we're taking so long. God of Barley, give me strength. Your mom is going to kill me. I'll name a dish after you in the tournament. Before I go, how about one more practice, hey Kiki? Sure. Why don't we practice with wind magic one last time? All right. We should have some time before Ma gets back from Auntie's house. I can't believe our little Mimi is all grown up. <sighs> it's really happening. enough underwear what I think so remember I gave you some of dad's stationery I want you to write every week Kiki stop acting like mom hey I have to make sure I'm not allowing you out to die in a ditch somewhere well I'll have plenty of underwear and stationery with me in that ditch <sighs> all right you better get going thanks Kiki you have no idea what this opportunity means to me oh I know don't screw up. And here, take this cookie jar with you. A little reminder of home.
Kiki's cloak. I have to get this back, you know. <laughs> they say it's good luck for that to happen when you first come into town. Huh? That's gross. Who says that? It's a capital thing. I'm Thrash, by the way. You're looking to register for the tournament, aren't you? Oh, yes. I'm Mina. Nice to meet you. How'd you know I was here for the tourney? That's a knife bag at your side. And you've got a pan handle sticking out of the back of your satchel. Right. <laughs> Marking the other contestants is easy. You can sense a special aura about them burning with excitement. <laughs> Look at me getting all worked up. Anyway, this is the back of the line. Up there with the pink-haired woman is where we register. Wow, that's a lot of contestants. This isn't even the half of it. I hear there's somewhere around 50 hopefuls. That's so awesome. But this line, yeesh. I just walked 30 miles, and I don't have the energy for this. Well, you can cut in front of me if you like. Really? You're so kind, thanks! Okay, this isn't gonna do. Time for some Mina magic! Huh? I'll see you around. Gotta go! <laughs> Excuse me! Pardon me! Just trying to get through! There we go! Next! Hey, she cut! Hi, I'm here for the... It'll be 10 gold to register. Yes, I have that. Here you go. Take this form and fill it out. Hand it to the gentleman to my right. Next! Mina Han, age 21, from the Windy Village. Title? Let's see... Well, Simon always calls me the Iron Stomach since I can eat anything. Done. Here is your registration number. Don't lose it. If you do, tough bricks. Tomorrow, your orientation is at 6 a.m. And the opening ceremony is at 4 p.m. 6 a.m.? I better go find a place to stay and rest up. Hmm. What's up? breakfast here. My wife cooks up a storm. If you're here for the tournament, you can stay for the entirety of the competition for 20. It's a steal. Perfect. Although, that leaves me with nothing left. And what if I get eliminated early? No, I'm not gonna get kicked out. I can do this. If you need to scrounge up some change, you could always do one of the jobs available in town. Wonderful. Thank you, sir. That'll do. Enjoy your stay and break the dish. What? Oh, it's probably another saying. Let me show you to your room. Wow, this is really nice. We do our best. I'll let you get settled in. If you need anything, you know where to find me. Thank you, sir. Maybe I'll just take a small nap. Is it? I need to get downstairs. Oh. 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 Excuse me. Oops. Sorry about that. No, I wasn't looking where I was going. There's quite a few smells wafting around here, of the unbathed nature. I just got in yesterday myself. I'm registered for the tournament and everything. I'm me- Wait a second. Oh no. Oh no! I slept through our 
orientation! Oh my. Well, if you need someone to get you up to speed, I'd be happy to help. I'm Kieran. And you are? Mina! That would be so great! We can use the practice kitchen so you're not going into things cold tomorrow. I'll act as your referee. But first, let's find you an opponent. Hi! How's it going? Hi. Let's talk. Thrash, I was wondering if you'd like to get a little practice in. How about it? Sure. I live for cooking battles. We should have just enough time before the opening ceremony, and you won't want to miss that. Good. I see you've found a partner. Let's head to the practice kitchen and get started. Let's do this! do I need to do to make it into the brigade? You must challenge other chefs in town to matches similar to this. Official matches are carried out in the Kitchen Coliseum, overseen by Chairman Common and the judges. Contestants must earn seven wins to enter the final round. Chefs with three losses are eliminated. Well, that won't happen to us, right, Mina? No way! We're going to make it to the final round! <clears throat> yes. As for the cooking itself, there are three things to avoid if you don't want to lose points during judging. First, always incorporate the match's theme ingredient in your dishes. Second, make sure to place your dishes in front of the judges within the time limit. Third, don't leave anything harmful to the judges in your ingredients, like poison. There's also a way to gain points, and that's by using ingredients that match the judges' taste preferences. All right. I think I got it. Let's... Very well. Provide me with a dish predominantly flavored with earth. And your theme ingredient for this round is... Karana. Oh, I never thought I'd get to say this, but in the words of Chairman Common... Vive la Brigade!
Well done, you two. Let's see what we have here. Excellent work. Wonderful. It is with pride I announce our winner is Mina. Congratulations! <laughs> I was hoping this would calm me down, but now I'm more excited for the tournament to start than before. That was a great warm-up. Mina, you're a strong competitor. Really? Mm-hmm. You're so serious while cooking. It's admirable, but don't get too tense. I can see your mind racing in a million directions. Don't forget to breathe. It's funny how I forget to do that when I'm concentrating really hard. I've never battled against chefs from all around the country before. Just think of all the different cuisines and techniques assembled here for the tournament. It's a taste of the world. Speaking of which, I think I hear some music starting up. Let's go and enjoy the opening ceremonies. Good practice. Welcome, one and all. Victusia opens its arms to the world for the annual Battle Chef Brigade Tournament. We wait with bated breath to discover which incredible contestants will join the ranks of the brigade this year. Chefs, I implore you to search within yourselves and draw forth your deepest convictions and abilities. Tomorrow, the battles will commence. But for now, let us join together in celebrating the strength of our land and its people. Vive la Brigade! Attention! Rise and shine, soldier! <laughs> Instructor Russell! Mina Han, are you not feeling well? No, ma'am. I'm feeling great! Your fellow contestants have all gotten at least one match under their belts. Curds! Falling behind already? <laughs> you need to get moving, cadet. Yes! Wait, where do I even start? My dear. If you had just woken up in time, you would have caught the briefing. I'm so sorry, Instructor. There's no more time to lose. Get dressed and go warm up with Thorn at the Hunter's Guild. Y yes ma'am! How may I be of service? Greetings. Pecorino, shoo, shoo! Stop eating my experiment! Is this a pet store? Settle down, miss, and have some tea. Bree, Fontina, get out of there! I'm Mina, by the way. Charmed, Belchior, gastronomy wizard extraordinaire at your service. 
Wow, that's some title. What do you do here exactly? Well, my lady, I'm in the process of creating a super flavor enhancer. It'll accentuate the consumer's favorite flavors, so it'll be universally delicious. I'm calling it Ambrosia. How are you going to make this happen? My experiment requires me to extract the essence of a hundred different dishes, but the progress is slow. I'm looking for assistance, but you'd be surprised how many people in town are allergic to cats. Well, it sounds interesting to me. Is it a paid job? Of course! I'm a professional. The brigade funds all my research. So, how can I help? Most of my recipes are almost complete. I just need a hand finishing them up. Would you be so kind? Done! You're a natural! Stop by any time you have a free moment. It looks like Pecorino has taken a liking to you, and I'm sure he'd appreciate you visiting. Hello! Hey. report here for warm-ups. Are you... Thorn? Maybe I was too suffocating for her. Uh, pardon? I mean, is 20 messenger doves one too many? Maybe it was the Manticore trophy I sent. I'm sorry, but are you the one in charge here? Um, oh, yeah. You're another tournament baby, aren't you? Give me a second to strap up my boots and we'll head to the arena and see what you're worth. Sh sure Okay, you have your gold. I always have more challenges on the bounty board, so come back later. 
Or don't. Not many do. Most people are all about the coin, not about the hunt. Um, well, thank you for the instruction today. I'll put it to good use. Hey there, Blue! for the line order cook possession. Can you handle all the orders? My family owns a restaurant back home, so I've got some experience. I've never worked anywhere else, though. We'll get you into the swing of things here. Beat the tournament happening. I'm swamped with customers from out of town. I'm also a bit short-stiffed, since two of my sous chefs are off trying to earn their wings for the brigade. I'll do my best. Here at the Crescent, we prioritize the customer's time and hunger. Not everyone has the time or coin for an exquisite meal cooked by a real better chef. That's where you come in, recruit. Your goal as a line order cook is to fill customers' orders as quickly as possible. For each order, all that matters is that the requested taste gem pattern is somewhere in the dish. Our pans here don't even get hot enough to upgrade taste gems, so don't make any big plans for grandiose dishes. Here, try this on for size. Delicious. Appreciated. Oh. Well done, recruit. You've managed to exceed my expectations. <laughs> I do my best. Well, I hope you'll return. The Crescent could use a shave like you.
can we cling? Welcome, citizens and esteemed guests, to the inaugural day of this year's Proving Tournament. It is my great honor to preside over what will assuredly be a pulse-pounding centennial. The contestants before you have traveled from across Victusia to showcase their skills in the illustrious Kitchen Coliseum. Only an elite few will rise from the ranks and emerge as brigadiers. Let's hear it for their bravery! Mina Han loves dreaming up adventurous new dishes at her family restaurant. Hailed in her town as the Iron Stomach, she's sure to serve up intriguing creations. <sighs> My stomach's definitely not made of iron right now. Mina! This competitor is said to be a descendant of Grand Matriarch Kill and is known for her unorthodox ingredients. Shiv Zaya, the acid tongue! <laughs> You're not even worth it. Shiv! It's my pleasure to present our longest running judge, Ambassador Akebo. You're too kind, Chairman. It's an honor and a privilege to sit at the judge's platform for the centennial. Ah, there's nothing like a dish with plenty of fire to invigorate the senses. People of Victusia, I struggled with the choice for today's theme ingredient for weeks before it came to me during meditation. Simplicity. One of King Heinrich's favorite monsters to hunt and eat, charging across the plains and forests in dangerous herds. Bowron! Chefs, please place your dishes on the judges' platform within the time limit. Grace this kitchen with the best cooking you have to offer. Vive la Brigade!
this? My mom taught me. She was an amateur battle chef. <laughs> well, it's not like it's impressive or something. <laughs> of course not. Thank you for your hard work, chefs. Let's see what our judge has to say about your efforts. Wow! Expertly crafted. The Iron Stomach's done it. Mina Han wins. I did it. This tournament is becoming a joke. The dishes you put up would never have passed the standards of our ancestors. Nevertheless, it's customary in my culture to give the victor a token. Here. We use it to protect toddlers from getting burned when they first start cooking. What's up? Interesting. I am exhausted. This was only my first match. I'm gonna have to pace myself here. I haven't even realized till now that I'm hungry. I cooked all day and didn't eat anything for myself. <sighs> I'll eat a big breakfast tomorrow to make up for it. Look at her go. It's like a trash compactor. Huh? We're just admiring your appetite. You're like me. I could eat a whole food truck and still be a stick. What's a food truck? You're Mina Han, aren't you? I heard about the Iron Stomach at the opening ceremony. Oh, wow. No one in my village actually calls me that. Just my friend. 
I think the tournament committee tries to play everyone up. <laughs> Nothing special. <laughs> hey now, don't say that. Having a stomach made of iron is pretty incredible. Mine's made of paper. Plus, you're here. And only the best of the best are in Capital City. We'll see. Either way, I'm really excited for the opportunity. Had a go? Well, if you'll excuse me, I've got places to be. Graves to dig up. See ya! Oh, here. Catch! Huh. A metal trinket of some sort. What a strange guy. Did he say he was going to dig up graves? Thank <laughs> you.